you know, I'll be I'll be bold and say from a from a latency perspective, if someone wants to build a shared infrastructure, neutral host, um, open RAN, you know, seven two functional split capability, we're the only people in the U.S. that can offer it um, at scale today. The architecture of Vapor was built to support something like you know Ethernet based front hall, where you still have a seventy microsecond requirement on on that uh, on that front hall. Uh, to the to the radio, you've probably heard folks, you know, others that have built these sort of ORAN networks in other countries say that you know it's really a greenfield build that is needed in order to support. And we agree, like taking a bunch of central offices uh, and trying to do this with a bunch of CEOs, um, I, it really doesn't solve much in terms of the network handoff between a telco network or a private wireless network and a hyperscale cloud company, which is increasingly where the OTTs um, are living, right? Uh, it, it's, you know, more often than not, an over-the-top application that's gonna sit on one of the three big cloud providers. Uh, so it's important to reduce, and not just the cost, but the latency and the overall complexity from that on-prem or from that aggregation point to its closest cloud or the, or the core. Um, as some like to call it.